Why are you against Mike Pompeo? He failed to show the committee that diplomacy would be his first line and most vigorous line of defense. Wanting to make sure that we had a Secretary of State who had a pro-diplomacy orientation, not somebody who was asking for regime change. There's no reason that Mike Pompeo should be facing such blind and absurd partisanship right now. The fact is, he should be confirmed. Well, you don't know what's going to happen, so I wouldn't be recording. Yeah. With that, the clerk will call the roll. The ref, aye. Rubio, aye. Mr. Johnson, aye. Mr. Portman, aye. Mr. Paul, aye. I would think with this president, people would want a Secretary of State in place. I don't want to denigrate any members by saying this was a partisan effort. That would mean their vote was not a genuine vote, right? So I don't want to do that. But I will acknowledge that we're at a we're at a point place in history here that's most unique. I mean, it's a, it is a hyperpartisan atmosphere. We got the new Secretary of State effectively just you know this on on track now. If we're starting to understand what Donald Trump's view of the world is by his personnel decisions, there's been some big changes, and this is one of them. What does that tell us about what we are seeing about how Donald Trump sees himself in the world and what he sees America's place in the world as? I think it's really difficult to say. I mean, I think the, uh, you know, John, I wake up in the morning and one day we're, you know, we're going to put tariffs on the European Union and then by the end of the day we're not and then we're going to do it on Canada and, and then we're not and then on Mexico and then we're not and um, and then we're out of Syria and then we're not. So I, I don't know that, you know, that, that I can answer that. But what I can say is that, um, Having qualified people making recommendations matters a great deal. I believe that Pompeo will give the president uh, good advice, and I believe he will push back when he thinks he's wrong. And I think that um, he's developed a relationship with him where he can. I don't want to put words in your mouth, but I think you just said that we're 15, 16 months into the Trump administration, you still don't really know what his, what his view of America's place in the world I, is. You know, my guess is, is for him it's evolving. Right. I, I think it is.